Database marketing is a type of marketing that collects information about customers, like their names, addresses, phone numbers, and what they have bought in the past. This information is used to make personalized marketing plans that attract, engage, and convert potential customers. It is the process of organizing, interpreting, and analyzing new and existing customer data to learn more about customers and promote the product or service in a more targeted and results-driven way. It is a type of direct marketing that relies heavily on databases and statistics. Database marketing is a type of personalized marketing that promotes a product or service in a way that is more relevant to each person by using databases of current and potential customers. Customer relationship management, also called database marketing, is when you gather information about your potential customers so you can send them personalized messages that meet their wants or needs. The database has a lot of different types of information, like a record of purchases and demographic information. It gives the marketer more information about the people who might buy their products. With this kind of information, it's easy to figure out how to treat different customers in the best way. Marketing with a database is more than just getting information about a customer. In database marketing, it's important to know how people act. Once a marketer knows how a customer acts, they can offer solutions that are perfect for that customer. As solutions, you can use tutorials, videos, a certain product or service, or other things. Different kinds of database marketing. Database marketing comes in two forms, marketing to consumers and marketing to businesses. One, using a customer list to market. This kind of marketing is for people who sell directly to consumers. They get this information through things like contests, giveaways, discount codes, etc. Once the database is ready, the marketer can make personalized offers and send them to each customer by email, social media, etc. Once the database is divided into groups, it's easy to make it fit your needs. This means that things are sold to people based on what they want. 2. Business Database Marketing Businesses that do business with other businesses can meet their needs with business database marketing. Information for data collection comes from a lot of different places, like industry reports, event registrations, demos, etc. Compared to the consumer marketing database, the B2B marketing database is smaller. This is because the main goal of B2B marketers is to get big clients. How do you use a database to market? Getting information about customers is the first step of database marketing. There are a lot of ways to find out something. These include the history of a website, purchases, responses to campaigns, customer surveys, letters, and so on. A complete database has information from a lot of different places. It is important to keep the database up to date because one assumption should always be the same. Tastes and preferences change over time. For database marketing, different kinds of customer data include acquisition data, demographic data, website slash app activity history, purchase slash spend history, campaign response history, loyalty program data, customer surveys and questionnaires, correspondence history, location data, social media activity, third-party ad tech data, etc. How to put together a marketing database. 1. Write articles that show how you think. You should write articles about things related to your industry and then use them as content, which is content that a reader can only see if they give you their contact information. 2. Give out tests for free. Businesses can get basic information from their customers by giving them free trials. Then you can run ads to reach people who chose free trials. 3. Make something for free. Using this method, you can get information about people who are likely to be interested in your product or service, which will help you build a customer database for marketing purposes. 4. Find out more about your clients. If marketers want to build a marketing database, they should think of ways to get customer information at the checkout. 5. Acquire a business contact database. A business could get a list of their prospects' business contacts by working with a data provider. 6. Ask people who visit your website for information. Marketers can use cookies to find out more about the people who visit their websites. 7. Put a chatbot on the page for your business. Using a regular chatbot or a Facebook chatbot will not only help you get customer information, 
but it will also get more people to sign up for your list. Some of the best ways to get the most out of your database marketing campaigns are 1. Decide to whom you want to sell. You need to know who your target audience is if you want to get good at segmenting your database. Who would be your made-up, perfect customers? What do they get paid? What are they interested in? Create a full and detailed profile of this shopper. Only the information you use to create your ideal customer is really important for your business. So, your main goal should be to find out only those things about your possible customers. 2. Collect and compare data with other departments. Even though this step might seem time-consuming at first, it is very important because it can save a lot of time. Your database will grow and, hopefully, be as accurate as possible if you share information between departments. 3. Finding the right place for your database. If you choose the wrong software, it could hurt all the work you do in the future to keep your database running. It would be helpful if you had good full database software. It should be simple to change and easy to back up. If there are a lot of problems, your work will be for nothing. Your software should come with all the tools you need to make collecting and keeping track of data as easy as possible. 4. Find out what you need to know. Your data needs to include acquisition, demographic, technological, activity, transaction, correspondence, and psychographic data. You should try to think about all of these things when making the ideal customer. People in the world of marketing can think of a lot of new ways to be creative with this mix. 5. Respect the right of a customer to privacy. Keeping the database is all about making things more personal. But in a time when people talk a lot about data privacy, how personal is too personal? This is just one example of a problem with customer privacy. The same thing could also be a problem for the security of your database. The business that does this has to deal with these issues. If the customer doesn't trust that your company will keep their information safe, they might not give you true information about themselves. Again, this leads to wrong information, which costs the company more money. In conclusion, building a marketing database requires a systematic approach that involves gathering customer information through different channels, such as checkout, website cookies, and chatbots. A business can also acquire a list of prospects' business contacts through a data provider. To make the most out of database marketing campaigns, it is important to identify the target audience and create a detailed customer profile. The data collected should be shared and compared across different departments to ensure accuracy and the right software should be chosen to manage the database. Finally, companies must respect customers' right to privacy and ensure their data is kept safe and secure. By following these guidelines, businesses can effectively leverage database marketing to drive growth and profitability.